YT stands for Yes, Boss Boss, so back in the interview, and welcome to um, a channel. Welcome to a What the hell am I saying? Welcome to yes, another video of Doctor Who. Um, this is the last episode um, of the se of the year, but we have the new year, the New Year special coming along our ways on New Year's Eve or day, whichever the two. Um, so um, never mind about the TARDIS console covered up with stuff. It's again room decoration. In fact, I've got two cans of paint here. Um, waterfall colour. So if you haven't seen that video of me taking my LEDs to replace down, then check it out because I know it's boring like, but it just gives you an idea of what I was doing. In fact, I bought myself that, which is a, it's going to go on my door for me for my bag, so it's not hanging on my wardrobe all the time. Um, as for my strip lights, I've put them away. In fact, it's in a blue box. Um, Christmas lights, what I bought. Uh, I was testing them out today, and pff, I was just thinking of what I put them up, but I'm not even going to get the painting done until January, but can't wait until all that painting's done downstairs and that, so then I can actually start on my own room. But anyways, um, how, what did I think to the episode of Doctor Who? Now, it was actually one of the best storylines I've ever seen. Um, because, in fact, I like, I like the Doctor Who reference from when she said she can turn like sort out a planet like she turned a Sylvine back to an egg you know I like the little uh, um, Knife Doctor reference there um, and also having the ability to for the TARDIS to have a bit more of a depth of what it does so we've got more of a bit of function of what the TARDIS does now Graham was really upset about again Grace being cut off like that from Tim Shaw which has made appearance again, which has slightly baffled me because I thought Tim Shaw was killed or sent to another planet, but no, he managed to recover. So um, with the Tim Shaw um, coming back, um, adds a bit more of a dramatic scene, especially when Graham um, wanted to kill Tim Shaw, but. The Doctor wasn't keen on that idea, as she said, if you used to do that, you will no longer be allowed on the TARDIS and you wouldn't be with me no more. So, and Graham didn't want to agree with it, but he, tr he tried doing his best. And alright, he's not shot, he hasn't shot the Ice Warrior, not the Ice Warrior, that the, 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 what am I thinking, the Ice Warrior and Tim Shaw the same? Um, to, he hasn't shot the yeah. Um, he hasn't shot Tim Shaw. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Um, as yeah, as uh, got a bit of stuff going on with him and Ryan. And actually, Ryan fist bumps um, Graham, and Graham and Ryan talk about it, and this this start bonding to each other. Which is a nice sweet bond. Um, overall, what do I think to the episode? I think it was a great episode, better than all the others. And for those who's going to say, oh, it's too political, oh my days, oh, can you still watch the show? Um, this hasn't got anything political of my own knowledge. There's nothing political going on. All I know is to try to relate back to a couple of episodes of Doctor Who, which I quite like. And I like the fact that it did a follow-up episode of um, what happened to Tim Shaw, as we had a follow-up of uh, a quite a few um, follow-up of episodes of Doctor Who in the past. So it was good to see um, Jodie Whittaker having that type of um, a scheme there. Uh, I think the Doctor has actually been more like a Doctor in this episode than any other episode, um, as she demands what she wants but the only thing is she's breaking her own rules slightly for the grenades and stuff um which i suppose that could have worked a little bit better if you was to figure something else so yes now only one more episode left 
the last episode of season 11 or series 11, whichever you want to call it. And I'm hoping it's going to have a Cyberman or a Dalek story because from the trailer um, we see things blowing up and I think it might be related to a Cyberman or a Dalek because they are most popular aliens out there full stop so thank you for watching please like and subscribe unfortunately no shout outs which is kind of upsetting but then again it does save me a little job and able to me do other stuff while it's uploading so yes but anyways um that's it really um hope you enjoyed this video also press the subscribe button if you are new and also press the notification button as well to be notified when i next upload Hopefully this room's going to be, be in a, a, a better shit than it is at the, at the minute. Because I've got things to like sort out. Um, the strip lights are down. Everything's down. Um, including me Doctor Who displays down. Because again I don't want to be getting that covered in paint now do I. Um, the only thing that's covered up at the minute is the TARDIS console. I know my dad's written with me about to get rid of it. Because... I don't want to get rid of it. In fact, you can slide it off. Now, I will be doing a video about that because six sec, go away, you're so boring. Um, um, a Fallen Gaming uploaded a video. Um, I didn't know he was doing it, but he uploaded a video of what I sent him through, what, through WhatsApp because um, um, he helps me out with videos. It's with my fake account. Anyway. Well, I say fake account, it's actually a, a number that I don't use. Um, but I use it for like other people. Um, it's not my real number. Um, and um, I sent him a video of it um, of because he wanted ideas for his TARDIS console, what he was building. And um, he, he uploaded man. Um, so he didn't have to. Like he said to me, no, do you want me to take it down? I'm like, no, 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 don't take it down. If you want it up, you can have it up. It's your channel. But um, it's been updated, so I'll be doing a bit of a video of it, like, yeah. It's easy to take down, you can just literally s slide off this piece of, like, cardboard area. Um, it's got currently a sonic screwdriver in there, so I can still use it. Um, in fact, it's got this light here, which is covered up. Let's see if I can just switch it on. As you can see, it's actually on a, on a, on a, um, a lightsaber, but I've disconnected the sound chip in it. But I can still connect it up and make it work again if I wanted to. I've just extended the wire to the speaker. So every time you tap it, it changes colour. So I need something to keep that steady because it's just because just, it went in my uh, epi in my episode, it toppled over a couple of times and trying to. And I didn't realise I had it on blue. But in fact the audio works pretty well with the um phone and the do phone on the console. And the microphone was plugged into my um it was in fact it was clipped onto me ward uh, gaming cupboard. Right, on that note I've got to get going, I've got things to do, um people to see. Why did I say that? I don't even see no one mostly. Uh, but anyways, thank you for watching and I'll see you on the other side. Alonzo Alonzo. <laughs>